Hey all thanks for tuning in on another adventure. Now today we're heading out to the 10th annual Giant Loop ride. This is something that they put on every year. Giant Loop is a company that makes some pretty awesome luggage for motorcycles. It's basically a gathering for a bunch of like-minded individuals to come together and explore this awesome area of the state and uh, have fun. This is my first time attending this, and it's also my first multi-day motorcycle trip, so lots of new experiences, not entirely sure what to expect, and also lots of learning, uh, especially when it came to filming this adventure. So I'm gonna do my best to fill in gaps along the way where I maybe forgot to film, and um, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy the video. All right, we're here in Burns getting some non-ethanol premium. It is a scorcher out today. It's about 85 or 87 out right now. Not too much further to go. All right, so anyways, we just filled up here in Burns. And uh, now we got about 30 miles or so to go. And we will be at Crane Hot Springs for the Giant Loop Rally. It's a scorcher, 91 degrees out right now, so definitely hot. I should have put on some chapstick. But we're gonna cruise more highway and uh, get you guys up when we get there. This event spans Friday through Sunday, and Friday is when most all of the riders show up. Some come on Thursday, but Friday is really the main day, so that's the day that I decided to roll in. And it's about 3 o'clock in the afternoon right now. Cool. Perfect. Thank you. Awesome. And then for camping is just that way, straight. Uh, okay, cool, appreciate it. This year was the biggest year for the ride with over 300 people registering. Uh, as you can see here, lots of vendor booths set up from a bunch of cool companies and the Harley Davidson trailer with all the demo Pan America bikes in there. So yeah, big year, lots of people and lots of riders. I was lucky enough to find a spot for my tent in a quieter corner of the area and had this little hill that led up to the lake behind me to kind of block off some of the wind. So it's pretty windy out here, but just got the tent all set up and I'm gonna go walk around, I think, and explore and kind of see what the schedule of events is and maybe sign up to ride the new Harley Davidson adventure bike. But it's pretty hot here. The wind is blowing pretty decently, but uh, tomorrow's supposed to be really awesome, so. So before I left, I had actually thought about bringing my KTM out here on a trailer instead. That way I could have the camper and the fridge and just be a little bit more comfortable. Unfortunately, the KTM didn't fit on the trailer that I had. Uh, so I was actually surprised to see how many people trailered and brought motorhomes and things like that out here. Definitely going to do that next year because the ride into Burns is just not that awesome and it's definitely a struggle on the way back home after a solid 10 hour day of riding. So that's probably what we're going to do next year. I believe this was the first event that Harley brought their trailer and all these demo Pan Americas out to. So we were kind of like the first group that got to ride these bikes. And I have to say, I'm pretty impressed. I think Harley did a great job on kind of their first entry into this adventure bike market. Um, there's a lot of compelling features to the bike and they really brought a lot to the table and did a lot of homework on kind of what people are looking for. 
Um, if long-term reliability on these bikes proves to be good, then I think they're going to sell a ton of these things. Giant Loop was gracious enough to provide refreshments for everybody, but now it was time to attend the mandatory riders meeting and just kind of learn about the area, what to expect, and listen to some words of wisdom. experience an emergency out there, we happen to have expert on-site medical support, our friends from Adventure Medics and Colby. So I just got back to the tent uh, where my camp is set up to chill for a moment and uh, regroup. I'm um, going to be taking my chair over to um, kind of the central area. There are going to be some presentations and stuff tonight. So I'm going to go walk over there here in a bit, but just had dinner. It was really good. Barbecue pulled pork dinner with beans and coleslaw. Super awesome. Um, the weather's been good. The wind calmed down a little bit. Uh, it's going to be super windy tomorrow though, I think. Uh, it was pretty hot today too, almost 90 degrees and there's no no trees around here or anything so kind of just had to find some shade and hunker down but uh, tomorrow morning at 8 a.m. I've got the demo ride on the new Harley Davidson um, adventure bike which I am looking forward to trying it out uh, definitely out of my price range but I'm always I, I just love motorcycles so It'll be awesome to get a ride on that and kind of give you guys my thoughts. And then after that, we're going to take off for the main ride of the day and head up over the north part of the Steens and into the Alvor Desert and uh, just kind of mess around there, make a day of it. It's a super, super pretty area. Um, we took a trip there, me and the wife, uh, back what, 20 into 2020, and uh, it was a pretty good time. So I met two other guys, and so I think we're going to link up and do that route tomorrow um, and maybe some other people will come with us as well so it should be a pretty awesome time but uh, I'm looking forward to going to bed tonight and resting up and waking up in the morning having a nice hearty breakfast and uh, yeah getting out there on the trail and having some fun um, the camp here is pretty this is an awesome area it's super pretty there's a little lake right here behind me I'll show you guys but it's absolutely beautiful out right now and uh, the weather's pretty ideal. But anyways, I will catch you guys here in a little bit, probably as we're out over there doing some other things. Um, it's kind of hard to remember to film and stuff as I'm talking and uh, having fun doing other things, but I'll do the best that I can to bring you guys along on this uh, with the main activities being tomorrow. As the sun went down, Giant Loop had a series of presentations lined up, some good information, some good stories, and funny jokes. It was a really great time and an awesome way to cap off the evening and get you stoked for riding the next day. All right, just got back to the tent and got things kind of situated and getting ready for bed now. Let me show you guys just how cramped it is in here with all of this gear. So yeah, pretty cramped um, when you're camping off a motorcycle like this and you're putting your gear in here. Um, but anyways, I'm having an awesome time. Um, the wind died down. It's going to be a nice calm night, I think. Some great presentations tonight. It was a really good time, but uh, Looking forward to tomorrow morning and the ride that we have ahead of us tomorrow as well as demoing that new Harley and uh, all the other activities lined up for tomorrow. It should be a really good time, but um, I'm going to go to bed now and I'll catch you guys in the morning. Alright, here we go. Oh sh**, do I not have any rear brake? Oh f**k.